Welcome back to Forensics Team. I mean, Trauma Team. Hi, Doctor. I'm ready to use my stethoscope and my magnifying glass. I forgot what we need to do next. Well, we can always ask a little guy. We've already talked to all of the testimonies. Yeah, let's uh, let's see what's going on here. Ask our buddy. Right, I think we're gonna... Right. Oh, yeah, here we go. Sorting through some information. All right, let's... Uh, what do you got for the fan? Nothing. Nope. Uh, how about... That's, that's, that's how about perfect. this right here? Dennis's income. How about... Not enough blood. Oh, uh, not enough blood in the shirt. Okay. Uh, <laughs> oh, wait, this is being exam... Oh, that's, yeah, that's being that's analyzed. being analyzed. Oh, uh, Dennis's condition in the blood. Yeah, there's actually some blood. Okay. What? Uh... De uh, Dennis and the... in the thing, and... Bam. Hmm, it's true. That really? This does have to do with the victim. How? But I wonder why. I get the feeling that there's something very wrong about this. Two accounts from the people who saw Dennis seem to differ dramatically. The difference is... Oh, uh... Behavior? His behavior? Hey! Hell yeah! Solid evidence! Dennis the Bush. <laughs> Hey. Hey, hey, man, step indeed. back. At first Way to be a shover, like dude. Oh, sorry, pusher. When pusher comes to shover... On the one hand... And then he just trips you down the stairs. His life. On the other, a man with suicidal depression? We all wear different faces. Either one of these clues is false. Mine I can hang on the wall. Shady business that I haven't sorry, did I ever mention I was Leatherface? Uh, uh you, you, you did not. <laughs> oh, oh okay, I see, I see. You're always wondering what the farting of the chainsaw in the background was? It was me. You know, it's, it's glad enough after all these years. Alright, so how about uh, signs of asphyxiation and not enough blood? W was that a combo we tried? Nothing? Uh, can we analyze this g the guy? I don't think there's anything to analyze, because that's, that's solid. There's nothing more to do with that. Uh, then I think we're good here, because that's still being analyzed. It is. Maybe... Um... Yeah, I think, I think we found I think the we different combination. Here, then. What is that sound? Maybe we need to look through more testimonies? Because we took a look at the body. We did. Uh, I don't think we have any more testimony to listen to. Let's listen to her testimony again, just to be safe. No, we don't have anything yeah, we already to... Heard that. already heard that. Yeah, we're good here, so... Take the body! Or maybe exit? Oh, wait! Do we need to go back to the room? Because we got, like, that analyzer thing, and we analyze stuff? Yes! Okay. All right. right, the luminal! Luminal! <laughs> Find blood! Where is the blood at? I bet it's probably where the blood's at. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! How about the uh, table? Try the try the table. Nope, 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 nope. I nope. nope. meant to go over here. It could be anywhere. Oh. Whoa! Loom all that stuff! So there were blood stains here, too. That's a lot of dead. That's... that's... <laughs> there is so much dead on the floor. Deceased, we may be able to use this with something else that we know. Right. Any more? Yeah, uh, check over here by the door. You, you got me curious. Uh, scooch. Okay. Ah! Ah! This, there's a reaction There's blood on the thing that locks the door, door, which means that somebody else did it besides him, the my bad job! As well. But how? I don't know! But how? That's a little guy to figure it out for us! Oh, jeez. Oh, boy. Come to think of it, the door to this room was chained shut when the fire hmm. started. Could this be related to that in some way? Probably not. You know what I think is going to end up happening by the end of this? What do you got? We're going to have to do surgery on the guy that killed him. Oh, no. And that's how we get connected. Uh, try the uh, ceiling fan. Oh. 
Hey, hey, are you awake? <laughs> Oh, I knew it! How to get on top of the ceiling felt like that. Oh, oh it's the man. core that they probably used to strangle him. To strangle him. They got strangled. Sick man. Sick man. Strangle. They got strangled with the rope that's on the ceiling fan. Now we're done. Let's go back home. Gotta strangle him. Gotta strangle him. This is a very morbid song now that I'm thinking about it. I'm gonna strangle the guy! It's gonna be fun! I mean, to figure out who did it! In game! Yeah, in sounds game! Good. Oh, we got a message. Yes. It sounds like we're gonna be wrapping things up here, so. Analysis, please. Oh, Dr. Kimishima, sorry for the wait. The analysis of the burnt material has come back from the laboratory. And... Calcium hydroxide was detected in the sample. Calcium hydroxide? Oh. You mean slaked lime? Huh? Yes, small amounts of quicklime were also detected. Oh, like lime to quick lime set things is a on fire. That releases a great deal of heat when it reacts with water. Oh, ah, I see. Hmm. Break the finger. <laughs> start the fire. But isn't it odd? If the killer wanted to start a fire, there are far easier ways to go about it. Probably. Hmm. It's our job. Less to detectable. That, isn't it? Okay, that's good. All right. Ashes has become burnt chemicals. So anyway, can we blood to blood? Blood to blood? Nope. Bl no blood to. Nope. Th okay. 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 Reason Dennis's blood was found on the screw in the door because is... Dennis touched. Oh, uh, the killer was <laughs> killer was finger baby. <laughs> yes, of course. Because he touched it! No, he didn't. Do the. It's a uh, blood splatter. Oh, touch the murder weapon. Never mind. I'm sorry, I just got you hurt a lot. There we go. Excellent hey, reasoning! That was excellent reasoning. God, I love that portrait and her lovely blue eyes glowing through this. Oh, it's great. have to. If the weapon was. The murder weapon was. A screwdriver! Right? So I'll explain the wound so. on his side. There we yeah. go. Yeah! That was the thing that yes, did it, I bet. It was likely used to both loosen and tighten that screw. Oh! Then the screwdriver left the That's how the they locked the door. Tracks. Okay. How about uh, blood on. <laughs> Nothing on the real murder. Uh, blood on this? Nope. Nope. Uh, oh, uh, duh. Screw. Oh, here we go. How was the room when the firefighters arrived at the scene? The entrance was closed, but was it completely unaccessible? It was chained and deadbolted. Or was it locked only by the chain? Locked only by the chain. Hey! There we go. That's right. The chain on the door... Yeah, that could easily crashed, break a chain. But the door the itself deadbolt. wasn't locked. Um, sorry, but the door only opens about 15 centimeters with the chain attached. Still enough! I don't even think a small child could get through a space that small. Then that's, that that must be who killed him then a small a child small child or his neighbor the old lady <laughs> oh <laughs> he had it coming <laughs> removing one screw removing one screw jump kicking through it. Yes. <laughs> we're up, we're up. <laughs> I love these gag answers they're so good this loose screw tells us everything everything With the screw removed the entire plate on the door can be swiveled around by the doorknob. The plate itself is about 20 centimeters long. Oh, so the gap solving the case. To of course. Solving the case. Oh. Let's go. Let's go. Yeah. What's How a centimeter? Somebody have to be that he oh, couldn't God, I think it's like an inch. Size. Oh, what the hell's an inch? I, I know what an inch is, but what the hell's a centimeter? That's uh, it's about the one one hundredth of a foot. Okay, thank you. Whew. Okay. So the that was very wrong, by the way. Do not affect my metric. Do it's not. Hundred, it's a hundredth of a meter. It's, I know. <laughs> do not. Do not go with what I say. No, it's called a centifoot. <laughs> Don't believe everything you hear on the internet, please. Except from this guy. This guy knows what he's talking about. I'm a about. fucking idiot. Hundred percent truthful. I suck. <laughs> Don't do it. Don't listen to me. I'm sorry. Are you guys figuring out the case for us? Yes. Huh. That's how Still, they performed the locker room murder with a screwdriver. They didn't lock the door. Then the kind of, but Except in a way that did. did, but yeah. Uh, fan on fan. Fan on fan. Yes. 
Bam! These two can be combined into one. Thank you for that, Kimishima. Wham, bam! Thank you, fam! Oh, that was pretty good. Okay, we're almost there. Break in the fan, break in the fan. Uh, ashes on fan. Why there was a rope around it in the first place? Because it burned. Because it killed him. Uh, ashes on fan. Ashes on fan. The fire yes! began near the fallen. I'm a genius. Calcium hydroxide was found in the substance on the floor there. <laughs> Calcium hydroxide is formed the a reaction of quicklime and water. <laughs> that reaction creates something else as well. Heat uh, is created. Uh, which makes the fire. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Quick lime releases 65 kilojoules. Kilojoules? When it reacts with water. Per mole. Oh, wow. wow. This was the Did I ever tell you when I asked a teacher how, how to describe a mole? First, you would I said, a what's a mole? The and they said, it's a unit of measurement. I was like, you would also measuring what? A mole. Around the floor it measures atoms. The there we go. That's the when answer the I was looking over, for all those years ago. It's like, well, like what, what does a centimeter measure? But centimeters. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think my teacher fire. liked me very much. <laughs> I can see why. He's an idiot. <laughs> The reason the killer used a such an elaborate trick to start a fire was... Uh, to prove how smart he was! <laughs> Variety! <laughs> That's just how he rolls! What?! Three of these are gag answers! I love it! The best part is, That's she's right. thinking of these things! Let's see, it must have been because he wanted something. to be cool and fly and baller. Variety? Yes, hmm. that must be it. The spice of life! Of course! Oh my yes. god! I've got a breakthrough! It's he because he wanted to, to be poggers! ...until the fire began. Um, Dr. Kimishima? What You're the, right! That had to have been it! I mean, during the time this game came out, what the hell is poggers? <laughs> the fact that she's saying this, though. <laughs> oh my god, Dr. Kimishima, that's an anachronism! <laughs> wow, Dr. Kimishima, you got the riz! Uh, you... <laughs> Two things you start the fire where are the bed and the glass. Uh... <laughs> uh and there it goes. Willpower and pyrokinesis! <laughs> This is not shimming on my tent side! It's the Sealy fan and a rope. Thank yes. You. Thank you very much. By the way, she does got that Riz. Yes. Look at those eyes. I oh, no. I know Riz stands for charisma. I do know things. I say a lot of dumb things. The killer wrapped one end of the rope around the fan. Yes. And tied the other to a table leg. Yes. When the fan activated according to its timer, the fan wound the rope up, yes. flipping the table over and spilling the water onto the quick line. However, there's still I one wonder how they tested this to make sure it actually worked. Why did the killer have to I don't know, you got those murder mystery place. people. Actually, that's a very good point. Why, go Why alert people to, to the fact that this person died? Well, if you find a dead person for that in bed when there's a fire, you won't think anything much of it. If you just got a dead person in bed, now there's questions. Now yeah, we, true. They were about to write this off until she came in and said, hang, hang on, wait a second. Uh, so Dennis's body would be found? Exactly. Hell yeah. To exactly. create an alibi. If you Due give them the... the like, they're they're eating the story that the killer is feeding them. That's true, that's true. To get them off his trail. But I know the, the truth! To be destroyed the truth is that you killed him! You killed the man! You killed him! No, no, she didn't kill him. No, no but she knows that you killed him! Instead, the, the guy the killed him, yeah. wanted to cause a commotion Boop. that would draw attention to the corpse. Now then, right on the forehead. why would that Boop. be? Why do you think that would be? To create an alibi! Hmm. Well, I mean, That's you were getting ahead of the story. By delaying the start of the this fire, is what happens when you play Ace Attorney, for those of you who have never have played Ace Attorney. This is what happens when you play th four more Ace Attorney games that came out after this game did. Yeah, when uh, you obviously know the answer, but you have to get through all the text in order for everybody else to catch up to where you are. Of the Ace Attorney Investigations, Layton vs. Ace Attorney, and then Ace Attorney 5, Ace Attorney 6. It is maddening. It, it is maddening. Solid evidence. A lot of football going around here because it is this maddening. Is the truth behind this mysterious Let me get the whiteboard so I can write down how good that joke was. Well, now you see, you had you, you had the punchline here, but to get there, you had to go through all this offensive and defensive positions, and he's really boxed in right here. Well, you see, he throws it off the anyway. What Screwdriver the on hmm, blood. There were two different bloodstains left in the deceased's room. Now, which of these bloodstains happened first? Ooh, hmm, this one. The big, the big one, I would say. The one with the most blood. That's the one I'm going for. Hey. Yeah. Because the there's not enough blood corpse. on there. Unless the corpse got up and walked over by itself. 
let's not rule anything out, Doctor. The deceased died where the I mean, blood this is found. the game that had anime cancer. Was carried to the this bed is the game that also removed the anime cancer, that almost. That why there was such almost. a small amount of blood on the bed itself. Alright, uh, blood... Moved corpse! Changed clothes! There we go. What do you mean it doesn't make any sense? Okay, fine. Murder weapon, bam. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Oh. Oh, uh, that on screwdriver? Move corpse. Broke thing. What? What do you want from me, then? Uh, yes. how about that? These oh, there we pieces go. Pieces of information I didn't notice because the bleeding had stopped completely, but this but... is a It's a stab wound. Oh, it's a screwdriver this stab wound. Yeah, exactly. Like oh! Screwdriver tip. Yeah. Or, the, or the handle. I don't know. What? It's the handle. It's oh, the handle. It's the handle. Of course it's the handle. <laughs> You're in yellow, oh no! The case is almost solved though! Come on! Yes. That's well then right. we need to stop making it's mistakes! Alright! Evidence that the weapon was jammed in so Come on, detective! The the I got it! I got it! Alright. Uh All right. what is this? That's just his voice. The voice. I don't think that's I don't think that's a uh, How about a, a, a clue. Uh signs of a screwdriver wound, move corpse. Nope. Still nothing on that. Nope. Nope. Injured hands. Nothing there. Really? Nothing on there? Oh, how about, uh... Signs of, as of, of asphyxiation. Uh, okay. Yes. Okay. These do lead the way to a definite truth. Looking at the location of the bruise, the tip of the screwdriver must have pierced Dennis's lung. Ow! Lung Ow, my lung. pulmonary emphysema, and he would have Ow, my pulmonary emphysema! This explains the when that happens. of hemorrhaging in the corpse's eyes. Oh, dead! Just in case you didn't what know. What actually happened that day is slowly coming to light now. With the emphasis on slow, you are correct. Alright. Still no. Uh, broken finger on broken dead? Broken finger. Nope. Damn it. His finger was the true cause of death. Uh, Move about... corpse! True yes. cause of death. There okay. we go, there we go. Can tell us how the murder happened. Okay, so you have to go ends, in order to, to, figure out, to figure out to figure out the story, person. basically. I know, we're at we're at the Dungan Rumpa portion where we the gotta do that, that comic bit where we gotta put everything together. There's a screwdriver. Yeah. Yes. One of them was Ice Pick. Also a very good murder weapon. <laughs> it's like, hmm, how about a thing that we haven't even seen? This, this could be it. Stab it into the neck. A few times. Uh, asphyxiation. Ta da! After this, the killer moved the victim to the bed. This is most likely because. Make it look like. Uh... Make an artistic statement! <laughs> artistic statement! <laughs> Maybe. Hmm. There we go, there we go. We got him! Ah! Solid evidence. But, man! The aesthetic Indeed. is just the beautiful. Hold on, do it in a pose where he's the shape of an L on his forehead. Ooh, Ooh. yeah, that is what yeah, I yeah, yeah. Get got, sucker. According to the evidence we have gathered. All right, now for everything else. What? What did you even put with what another? Oh, uh, try giving little man the voice. Damn it. <laughs> uh, voice with uh, voice with this. Voice with finger. Yeah. Do I okay, start I combining these? Is there anything more? Hey! Something doesn't quite fit here. We need to go check the personal effects one more time. One more time. One more time. Gonna check his personal effects. Ah, oh, yeah. Once more. What are we checking then? Because if he got stabbed right here. Yeah, where he got stabbed. There's nothing there. If he got stab- oh wait, did he get stabbed in the neck? Or the lungs? No, he pierced his lungs. Button? I see what you're looking for. Mm. Uh, gotta be looking for something here. And there's nothing else that we can look at? These are all of his personal effects? I think so. A button on the shirt. Oh, check the other side. Are there buttons on the other side of the shirt? There are, in fact, buttons on the shirt. Hmm. 
would think you'd see like a puncture wound or something, or something like that if you got stabbed in the side like that. Yeah. I don't see anything. Maybe like right here? Oh, there it is. Is that it? Nope. Hmm. Uh. Hmm. I don't see anything. Me neither. Maybe d check his corpse again? I don't know. Nope. So it's gotta be something on his personal effects because she specifically mentioned it. There's something that I have to check. Now I'm check the blood stain again. Nothing of note. Uh, how about over here in this area? Hmm, this is odd. There's oh yeah, the there puncture wound. Yeah, there. the fact that there is nothing here! They the changed his shirt to make it look more death. like a Seuss. It probably burned. A Jack Frost patch! Of course! Yeah! yeah blood stains from the stab <sighs> wound. There should be blood stains in a hole where the screwdriver went through his clothing. But there isn't! Nothing here. Inconsistent clothing. That it? Is that everything, Doctor? I don't think so. Can't find anything more for now. Okay, let's get out. Let's get out of here. Okay. So we could probably combine this shirt evidence with the other shirt evidence and put together that the shirts were swapped. Yeah, if we've unlocked something from there, maybe. For a flag, perhaps. All right. Uh, shirt with shirt. Yes. Yes! 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 According to Mr. Taylor's friend, on the day of the incident, Dennis had been wearing an expensive as shit shirt. So it's it's a it's a red sweatshirt, right? Yes. No, it wasn't. Maybe it was just a red shirt. <laughs> she actually sounded pissed. There we go. That's right. <laughs> He was supposedly wearing a, a red, red Portland Jack suit, shirt. But when his body was discovered, it was wearing <gasps> a red sweatshirt. A, I mean, a white, white shirt. shirt. Yes. His corpse was found wearing a white shirt. I was wondering when they would finally words, bring that up. His clothing had changed. Got to go step by step here. That was all we know. Got to get all the details. The it's it's a procedural, you see. Yeah, yeah. However, if he had there would still be a discrepancy. I grew up on the mean streets of Ace Attorney, sure. I know this. Because there's no indication of the stab wound. There's no drugs on it. He wasn't wearing a shirt. <laughs> there is no shirt. There is no body. The there is no Dr. Kimishima. I got caught up on Naomi Kimishima and also Weaver. <laughs> See, I thought you were gonna go, there is no body. Dennis is when he died! Killer changed Dennis. Uh, yeah, who on earth would steal Whoever clothes? Mr. Taylor, Especially off a dead guy. He was wearing after killing him. Look at that shirt of yours. The reason for doing no, that you don't. was... <laughs> it's a plain black t-shirt. You're not one. With a pocket, shirt. man! It's got a pocket! You know, a young guy told me that this was a frocket. To leave a beautiful corpse. And I have hated that word ever since. Frocket? A frocket. A front <laughs> pocket. <laughs> And I heard that, and I was like, God, that's the dumbest thing I've ever heard. Exactly. Let me stick uh, my wallet into my pocket here. Wound. Actually, no, wait, I'm going to put it in my socket. Yeah, apparently pocket on pants is normal. F front pocket, back pocket. But if you have a pocket on your shirt, it's called a frocket. All right, shirt with, hmm, yeah. I see. These two are related. Because they have no to be. I would, I would love it if she went, hmm, that yes, these the two are related. After death, Somehow. Naturally. The I knew it. After death. Oh. Killer really hated Dennis. Oh, it was broke. That makes sense. Broke while changing. Oh. And a lot of muscles not working, so that way, you know, the brain's like, hey, the fingers must be broken. Yeah. Now it's just, yeah, whatever. <laughs> Let it happen. The killer broke the corpse's finger while changing the Oops. shirt on the body. Dr. That's correct! How's the investigation going? Just finished. Deception, but the truth Closes briefcase. Revealed. I see. So we can't arrest the culprit yet. That's right. 
I need conclusive evidence that can help us identify mm. the killer. The most reliable giveaway would be if we could find a fingerprint at the crime scene. <gasps> We're going back. Oh, We're going back. There's one more after all. One yeah. more little toy there. Hmm. I'm not surprised. Time to feather lengths, dust all over the place. <laughs> the murderer was probably wearing gloves while the crime was being committed. Huh. Isn't there anything the killer might have touched? Our hearts. Something that would require him to take his gloves off? It's hard to think of anything. Well, hmm. the best evidence would be on a hard, slick, inorganic substance. It table. What size it is. Table, table, well, we table. We investigate the crime scene, the corpse, and what the corpse was wearing. Could there be anything among those items that the killer touched with the bare hand? We'll have to investigate further. Thank you, little guy. Oh, maybe the rope? Yeah, let's get out of here and go check. Smooth surface on the corpse or the personal effects? So, back to the evidence room. Hmm. Maybe on the corpse? Okay, never mind. Not on the corpse. How about the personal effects? So I so I kill you, stab you in the in the lung with with a with, with the knife, and you're dead. Now I gotta change your shirt. Okay. It's a clean white shirt. Yeah. But the gloves I used to kill you are all covered in blood. So if I want to make it look like, you know. Yep. Oop, no. The shite. There's no damage to the shirt. That apparently wasn't what they were looking for, though. Like, maybe... Uh, well, he said, she said there was something on here. A button. Maybe it was this button. Yeah, the other buttons. But the button that they did touch... The killer put this shirt on the victim's corpse after the murder took place. That would mean that the killer would have had to button the shirt up as well. But as we all know, you can't button up shirts with shirt gloves. With gloves on is no easy task. If my predictions are correct. Oh, analyze. analyze. Yeah, just it, no. Now we're heading back to the apartment. Hell yeah. Can't believe I'm spending this long on a, on a forensics case. I'm surprised you didn't remember how long this took from the millions of years ago when you played this. I'm surprised too. You'd think I would know. But then again, as I've been noticing, you are the type to speed read. Just flipping through everything. Yeah, I don't let people finish their lines. I'm like, oh, all right, my eyes are faster than your mouth. Uh, oh, that was easy. It was almost like this was the last thing we had to find. Great. Run the print through yeah, the list of registered yeah, thinking about how you put that on, and yep, you if you want to put on that button, you have to put your right thumb directly on top of it. To me. Such an attention to detail has gone into this. It can't possibly be a first-time offender. There has to be a match for this fingerprint. Ooh, a records. serial killer? I sincerely hope so. This case should Die, be Captain soon. Crunch. <laughs> Crunch Solid dies, evidence! <laughs> oh. Uh, I think we've reached a conclusion! It's time to finally solve this case and come to the end of the three-part arc that is the first forensics case. Cox gun. The dead shall speak. Let's put together the truth of what happened. Final conclusion time. I seem to not be able to move my cursor. I'm noticing the that too. In this case is 30-year-old Dennis Taylor. This guy right here. As there's no yeah, he looks like a drug murder, dealer. It's a suspected suicide. However, the victim had a hidden other side. He liked to go to the ballet on weekends. This card is the one with proof of that. He judged dog shows. Okay. Oh, right, right, right. So, the pusher. The pusher, you think? Yeah, the other side. Yes. Well, yes. 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 Ball, yes, indeed. Also yes. Drugs. This case is related to the victim's <laughs> drug. We're going through the comic panels. Like, she's giving a seminar, and it's like, okay, so what did we learn about Dennis? His secret identity was... He's, he's a drug dealer, man. Proving the evidence there was a motive for murder was yeah, the missing the drugs. Missing drugs ma yes, ma'am. Indeed. The drugs Indeed. hidden behind the shelf were missing. <laughs> I know these are going to be 
stupid hard later, down to the smallest detail. So what was his shoe size when he stepped into the room? The real cause of the victim's Student, death. Student, that is not needed that. for this investigation. Size 12, ma'am. I know that because of this car. Ha! There's a size 13 footprint. True cause of death for the victim of this car is... Uh, is it right here? Is that... Mm, yeah. Is it? Oh, uh, no, no, no. Uh, go, go to here. Uh, hold on a sec. Go That's back to the question. That's how he escaped. The true cause of death for the victim of this case would it be the? Yeah, because that has the cause of death. Yeah, oh, there yeah, we go. there we go. The wound on the wrist was not the true cause. Which card made it look like he died? How about the one that made him that died? died. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> disguised the murder as a suicide. This card proves the misdirection used to hide the murder. I got, I got it. I got this one. I got Slide this one. It's, 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 the locked it's, room it's, trick. It's, uh, appearance the, the of appear suicide. <laughs> <laughs> what proves it appeared like this? The appearance of... <laughs> oh, that's the appearance of the body. But not the trick that he used. So it would be the locked room murder? Nope, 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 nope. No, no. to get serious. Evidence proves that it's something taken. Kind of I think you were right the first time. We'll choose this. See what that is. Nope. That's how they start the fire remotely. So it would be, it would have to be this then. Yeah, hide the okay. true cause of death. Yes. Right. The Read. Suicide covered up the we, we can get this. No rush. The next topic is the secret. We're at the end. I know. The, the murderer used a trick to create Don't a locked room panic. mystery. It was made we'll to seem be as if the victim fine. was the finger. there. We'll be This card fine. shows the trick that had been used. This was the that had to have been the locker room trick. Yep. There's uh, a card that exactly. showed a trick. How about the trick the card? I thought this would clear his trail. And yet, the culprit had one more and way yet. to hide from suspicion. Making that the corpse look just when the dapper for his own depends. funeral. Starting the fire. This card shows how he went about Starting the fire. Years. The time of death occurred at a different time. Uh, read these carefully. Bye. Yeah. So, killer fingerprints, secret, of, secret the fire. of the fire, deceased voice. Oh, it might be this one. What's it say? Nope. Nope. Uh, how about this? Use a timer, uh, timer on the ceiling fan, so yeah. The murder took place three Because he already died and the fire happened. We think that, oh, he died in the fire, which oh, didn't happen. God. It's natural to assume that if the room was locked, then the crime and the fire would be at the same time. Hell yeah. But those foolish mortals had no idea. You know, I'm actually surprised they start Kimishima's However, section there was one thing the killer with a locked room murder. Some of the most complex murders, which means everything after this is going to feel like milk toast by comparison. This card is evidence of that task. But then again, we might also be dealing with the supernatural, so... All right. Um... He probably Ob couldn't button the clothes yes. with his gloves on. Obvious. No matter how small the buttons, I would love it when we get to the last card and we somehow still get it wrong. <laughs> Wait, what do you mean? Of a fingerprint can be used to identify him. Actually, a ninja came in and stabbed him. <laughs> must have been surprised. <laughs> just threw out the <laughs> whole case. <laughs> what? All, just upended the, the table. <laughs> Gone. <laughs> Everything this is destroyed. What he said at the very end. The victim's final words were... Would you like fries now? with that? Stop! You... No! Ah! Wow! A I knew it was the repair. I, I've said it was every single truth. person we got a testimony from. So, seeing that it's actually the repair man is... Yeah. Cathartic. Who's there? The it's the cable man! I was oh, about no! to say, repair man's here. I'm sorry. Oh, no! Surprised you. <laughs> it really was him. Hi. Why are you here? Oh. You see, uh, I hang out at the county morgue every day to make sure nobody gets close to finding out who I murdered. I need to have it fixed by tomorrow. I just need someone to talk to. I see. That sounds difficult. Flip him over the table. You see, I see a detective yep. hanging by hanging by, a, by by the morgue, going hmm. Oh, shoot him! <laughs> In instant transmission. Uh, 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 That's what you get, bitch. 
One thing I, know, I like about Trauma Team, it don't fuck around. It's like, I tried to, I tried to, to, this guy tried to kill me, yeah, I, I shoot him. <laughs> and then she I'm says, freeze. I'll fucking kill you, man. Ooh, that would have been a really cold line if she said, I see corpses every day. Do you want to add to the list? <laughs> I mean, we're here in the morgue. I could just put you right up top. Make it look like a suicide. <laughs> <laughs> Naomi. I forgot the code to get inside. <laughs> It's one 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 one. How do you forget oh, that? Right. I yes. Sorry, sorry, sorry. I've solved the case. Oop. I'll give you my report tomorrow. And my bill. The report can wait. Naomi, you must think of Oop. your safety. Huh. Clean his glasses Nobody for you. Lives forever. <laughs> don't don't boop his Even head. Even if I died don't today, it'd just don't, be don't, don't, boop, don't boop her head. Stop booping her head. Sorry, man. I don't I don't know where he gets like this. I can't take him anywhere. Just Poke her in the forehead and push. <laughs> st stop, stop! Stop poking the doctor! Stop! Don't poke the doctor! I'm glad I get poking privileges for all the doctors. <laughs> oh, I didn't think we'd ever get back here! I'm finally we're at Jack <laughs> Red's character select! What? Are, are you positive <laughs> they didn't want you to go one character at a time? That's probably what they wanted. But not for you! Nope, because, well, I mean... There is a timeline we need to follow, though, so... Well, how about next time on Trauma Team, we enjoy some other characters for for the first time in what seems like actual years. You know, I think you're right, because I think Tomoe Tachibana is next on our list. All right, sounds good. I think I think we should take a uh, trickle-down method here. Okay. Because think, think about uh, CRSO1 here. He's, he's, pre he's way he's, down he's there, He's pretty yeah. down there. Okay. So, all right, let's start the game proper. <laughs> <laughs> Thank God we got started. <laughs> <laughs>